Yeah, that's right. Entomologists say that this is the world's largest hornet. It is an invasive insect. So the plan tomorrow is to eradicate the nest. Now, this is part of an ongoing effort to stop this insect from doing environmental and economic damage in our state. Asian giant hornets making this tree home. The nest was found on private property in Blaine yesterday afternoon, and today researchers are rejoicing. I took a step back and realized we were actually standing right under the nest. We had in fact tracked her straight back to where she came from, and so we were pretty happy about that. The effort to track down this nest started days earlier. They were able to trap a few and attach radio trackers to the hornets, which led researchers to the right place. This discovery comes after months of searching for the invasive insects. Just a few of the hornets can kill 30,000 honeybees in a matter of hours. Stopping this cold is uh, very crucial because as, as everybody knows, uh, managed pollination is uh, a very key component of our agricultural commodities and uh, the systems that we have in place to grow food here in the U.S. And so uh, a very important fight. The hunt for hornets began in December. That's when the insect was first detected in the state. July, the first hornet was successfully trapped. And since then, several more have been caught, all in Whatcom County. The focus right now is on the nest. These hornets are known to spray venom, and that can actually um, cause debilitating eye injuries uh, that can uh, be permanent. That's why a team will be wearing face shields and thick suits when they move in to tackle this task tomorrow. And that nest is about eight feet up in that tree. WSDA says their team is going to need all of that protective gear because these hornets are able to sting repeatedly. Live in Seattle, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.